Okay, so then it makes sense that they make up such a high proportion of our overall body weight because if there are trillions of cells in the body and then every cell has multiple mitochondria yes. and then the most metabolically active tissue like the brain burns a huge amount of calories. The liver, slightly ghoulish fact, but this is one of the ways that they determine time of death. It's actually from the temperature of the liver because it's so metabolically active and it's deep inside the body. It cools slowly. I think most people are going to be familiar with muscles producing energy yes because when we exercise we produce more energy that gives off a certain amount of heat and we start to sweat yeah so that's what most people would associate with when they're doing strenuous work or exercise they start to sweat so each of those are metabolically active so we'd say tissues in the body that maybe consume the most calories yes okay so uh, mitochondria we could have three to four hundred in a, an average cell up to twenty five thousand in uh, something like a muscle cell so they really are quite plentiful quite numerous mm. they can uh, they burn glucose but they can burn fat mm. uh, and other substance even amino acids where if it comes to it okay starvation when your body gets to the stage of breaking down proteins for energy yes okay yeah 